Well, TLC, it's that time of year again. It's time for the annual Harvest Festival. A fun-filled day of celebration with music, dancing, games, and plenty of eating. It truly is an event like no other. But what is Harvest Festival? What happens after the music and dancing stop, the games are over, and the lights are shut down? In Matthew 9, 37 and 38, it gives the account of when Jesus saw the crowds of people and had compassion on them because they were helpless and confused. He then turned to his disciples and told them, The harvest is great, but the workers are few. So pray to the Lord who is in charge of the harvest. Ask him to send more workers into his fields. Now realistically, we can't all be in far off remote lands as full-time missionaries, but we can partner with those who are. It is this passion for the helpless and the weary which drives the event we see every year on the compound. It is seeing the harvest fields on a global scale and responding by not only sharing Jesus with these people, but also by feeding the hungry, bringing healing to the sick, helping the poor, teaching the uneducated, and offering comfort to the brokenhearted. Last year alone, we were able to give nearly 20,000 KD that went directly to dozens of missions all around the globe. This is only possible if we join together in making this amazing event another success. You can be a part of this by giving something. This can be in the form of prayer or your time volunteering, perhaps items for us to sell at the event, or just by giving a cash donation. Will you consider joining us in the cause to reach those whom Jesus loves?